for women and girls' rightful place in our world, besides their husbands, brothers, and sons. I want a world where all women and men, adult and young, have equal opportunities, freedoms, and choices to forge their own destinies and aspirations. Although uh, some will continue to try to sideline them, they'll never be able to silence them. And by providing women with an education, they get more of that self-confidence and the knowledge that allows them to, uh, to break through a lot of the barriers. We are fabulous in our 40s. We're even more fabulous in our 50s, 60s, and 70s. And we need to celebrate that and keep those opportunities going for women. So I want to give a voice to all these women and girls in conflict situations. Underrepresentation in leadership limits the presence of female voices and influence in important decisions. And it also deprives young women and girls of strong role models who can give life to their own dreams. We need to promote the visibility of female politicians and decision makers and create a safe and enabling environment in which they can participate in public life. But the things that make dreams possible most certainly are the right to an education, the right to grow up in a healthy environment, the right for girls and boys to be treated equally.